Also in Oakland this evening, we have some new details on the man police want for a deadly hit and run in Oakland. Turns out that he has a troubling criminal history. KPIX 5's Dahl Lin joins us now with what we've learned about the man who's still on the run, Doc. Neighbors have been coming by to this memorial to pay their respects. They're outraged by the senseless crime. Police say a mother, her young child, and the little boy's uncle were in the crosswalk going to a laundromat when they were hit by a car. That car never stopped. Police say the hit and run driver, 27 year old Rashanon Allen, has a criminal history. Court documents show in 2016 he faced a number of charges related to a murder case, including one count of murder and a special circumstance of felony murder in the course of a robbery. He was not convicted of the more serious charges. Instead, he pleaded no contest to accessory after the fact and was sentenced to three years at Santa Rita Jail. Santa Rita Jail officials tell us they released him last year. Of course, he's a cop for running. He should have stayed there. That's why it's called an accident. It, either he did it on purpose or it was an accident. Upset neighbors are mourning the loss of 30-year-old Alma Garcia and her six-year-old son, Angel Garcia. The boy's uncle is still in the hospital. The principal of Angel says he was a joyful little boy. He was just the kindest, sweetest, most resilient child. This family has been through multiple tragedies. Their home burned down. She says the house fire happened two years ago. Neighbor Christine Griffin saw the aftermath of the hit and run. She says it brought back bad memories. She survived a hit and run collision just a few blocks away. I just felt like I had that accident all over again, like I was hit and run. The only thing is I lived. I thought I died, but I lived. These guys are gone. She and neighbors say they've been asking the city to put in a traffic light at this intersection, Foothill Boulevard and 26th Avenue. Well, they're getting a high speed and they don't stop. It's a complete death trap. It's a street that people do sideshows on that is notorious in Oakland for speeding. Uh, there have been multiple car accidents right here in the crosswalk in front of the laundromat. The city's transportation director stopped by this morning and heard an airful from angry neighbors. He says they'll launch some kind of study to see what type of solution is good for this intersection. As for the suspect, there's a $25,000 reward for information leading to his arrest. That amount is higher than normal because of the gravity of this crime. Two fatalities. Live in East Oakland, I'm Dahlin, KPIX 5.